Okay, welcome back. In this video, we're just going to fill out this information as completely as possible. So what you do is just click on the little edit button there. And and, and when I say fill, out, fill this out completely, I do mean you want to have everything filled out as completely as possible. That is an issue with Google. Google will um, expect you to have all the information possible uh, when you fill this profile out that will help with rankings. So we need to first put the website URL. So down here we click on edit next to contact info. The phone number is already in there, but we want to add the website. So the website for this one is zulapowerwashing.com. Now I like to just highlight it here, make sure it comes up, and then I like to highlight it. Um, right click and click copy and then I like to right click and do paste in there so we make sure there's no misspellings in there that's important as well um, as far as add more contact info if there's a secondary phone number you can put it there um, you can also let's see they used to allow for faxes but apparently they don't anymore but that's fine we only have one phone number for this business so I'm gonna click save now the categories we added one primary category pressure washing service uh, let's see if we can add some more that would fit into this um, business and and you can do this by looking at the different pages that your client has on their website or the different services they offer so he has power washing gutter cleaning window cleaning graffiti removal paint removal so let's see if any of those um, are categories within Google uh, I know window cleaning is so let's add that one in there let's add in um, let's see what else we have gutter cleaning possibly let's see yeah gutter cleanings there and let's try paint removal nope uh, we can still put it in there I believe unless they've changed it and then graffiti removal oh, they have that in there so that's good okay so now we have five categories it doesn't mean you're gonna rank for all of these it depends on how much competition we have within the town we're trying to rank in but the first one is the one is the primary service where we're gonna make the most money because it gets the most searches and so you need to have that discussion with your client or think about your own business. What do you want to rank for primarily? And where are you going to make your most money? Because that's what you want to have up here in the primary category. Because that's really the one you're going to be ranking for the most. Click Save. It didn't like paint removal, so we'll take that out. Save it. Okay. Um, hours of operation. I'm going to put Saturday for him. I'm going to put 6 a.m. to 9 p.m. Monday through Saturday. So set that up however you would like. Special hours, I'm going to put, um, let's see, I'll put closed on Christmas for now. Closed. Okay. Um, for the introduction, now this can be important here. What I like to do is grab something off of the website. Let's see here. Preferably off the About Us page because it's usually a little bit more personal. Um, and let's see. Now, one thing I want to mention here is um, I have not set up his Yelp page or his Facebook page or his YouTube channel. So once I do set those up, I'm going to come in here and I'm going to um, create links to all three of those because those are powerful citations and you don't want to overdo it with links and you don't want to be putting a bunch of keywords into this section, but you want to have what's called LSI keywords, meaning um, so that so an actual keyword would be Missoula pressure washing. Uh, that's what somebody would type into Google. You can have variations of that, like um, Missoula power washing or power washing in the city of Missoula. Have words in between there. 
has synonyms, have variations of words, stuff like that. So I'm going to add a couple LSI type words in here. Um, let's see. Our mission is to provide our customers with a reliable power washing service. And this is where I can add like paint removal that I that they wouldn't let me add up in the in the category. And I might come back and change this later, but I just want to um, spell graffiti two Fs. Okay. And graffiti, okay. Okay, superior technology. I'm gonna put good customer service, that makes sense more sense. Okay. And then down here, later on I'm gonna put Facebook, Yelp, and YouTube. Uh, and I'm go and then I will highlight them. Click this little link button here, and put in the URL, and that will make it a live link that Google can see and other people can see. Um, so that be that that will help um, a little bit. Okay, so click save. Just one extra little thing that you can do that the competitors may not be doing, probably are not doing. Okay, that's all we're going to do for now. Uh, in the next video. We're going to come back to this screen and we are going to put in a profile photo and we're going to put in the other photos. Uh, but, this is, but it's very important that you edit the photos in a certain way, optimize them in a certain way before uploading them to the page. So I will see you in the next video.